The next question is from AP and possibly it's a series and sequence based question. The question says, <clears throat> the natural numbers are divided into groups. Group 1 is 1, group 2 is 2, 3, 4, next is 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 and so on. So and the question is find the sum of numbers in the 15th group. So there are two things which I have to find out. One, <clears throat> what are the number of terms in the 15th group and second, what are the terms in the 15th group. But obviously they are all consecutive numbers so some, taking the sum will be the sum of AP uh, for which we need to find out the answer of. If you look at the first term has got one term, the second group has got three terms, the third group will basically will have five terms, the next term will basically will have seven terms likewise, next group. So it's going ahead, so the group terms, number of terms per group is going ahead by 2, 2, 2, 2, 2. And we are looking at the 15th group. So from 15th group to the first group, there are 14 groups in between. Each group is going ahead by 2, 2, 2, 2, 2. So the number of terms in the 15th group will be 14 into 2, which is 28, plus the number of terms in the first group, which is 29. So <clears throat> the number of terms in the 15th group will basically be 29. Now the question is find the terms in the group. <clears throat> The, <clears throat> the last term in the first group is basically 1. The last group in the second, the last term in the second group is 4. The last term in the third group is 9. <clears throat> if you look at this pattern, 1, 4, 9 is basically some, or uh, uh, let's say, the square of that particular number, which is 1 square, 2 square, 3 square, determining the group number. So the 15th group the 15th group, the last number will be 15 squared, which is 225. <clears throat> the number of numbers is basically 29, so it's going to be n by 2. How do you find the sum of terms of n and AP? It's given by n by 2, first term plus last term. Last term is 225, and there are 29 terms. I repeat, there are 29 terms, so the first term will become 197. So hence, the final answer for this question will be as simple as 29 upon 2. 197 plus 225. If you solve this, you will get the final answer 61192 to be the final answer for this question.